Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hello if you are new here. Today I want to do a really casual, chatty, sit down video talking about cool occasion outfit ideas. So maybe you have a gorgeous beach trip coming up, maybe you have a wedding coming up, a prom, a graduation, maybe, blah, 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 maybe you are at the bride, maybe you're going to the races. I've had so many requests on Instagram asking me for like prom dress ideas, the races ideas, bachelorette, hen do, wedding guests. So I thought I would just talk through a few of my favorite things and show you some new bits that I have ordered. So without further ado, get cozy, comment below and let me know what special occasions you have coming up. Do you have the races? Do you have a wedding? Let me know. I have a few weddings. I'm really excited. So I am personally on the hunt for wedding guest dresses. So let's go. First things I'm gonna pop me on the screen wearing it. So first things first, this one and everything I mentioned will be linked under the video. This is so beautiful. I have actually been wearing it to so many work events and I love it so much. Chiffon, long, gorgeous material, high neck. It's absolutely a work of art and it's so nice and floaty. Perfect for a holiday, a special occasion, will be gorgeous for a wedding guest. Nice and comfy as well. I also have a similar version of this which is a long sleeved purple one with like a little cut out neck. I actually have it in the short version and the long version, again, from the same brand, kind of chiffony, floaty, and so many people have said to me that would be amazing for a wedding guest. They're very, very similar because they're the same print, but one is short and one is long, and I think, like, it's just gonna be so good. I've been wearing it all the time for summer events. Then I have a long-sleeved white one. I don't know what the etiquette is with wearing a white dress to a wedding with print on. My bridal friends have said it's fine, but maybe just run it past a bride. But I have this gorgeous long-sleeved one. You might have seen I wore it to Harrods. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. I have it in the long sleeve version and also the high neck version. Even if you don't wear it to a wedding, you could wear it for a holiday, you could wear it to the races. I just think it's such a flattering dress. And again, so comfy and I think the print is so beautiful. Then I've got this one. I put this on and my boyfriend was like, oh my gosh, that's a bit out there. But oh my god, how fun is this? This would be so fun for like a bachelorette, the races, a really special occasion. It really reminds me of a H&M collaboration, a designer collaboration that they did. I think it's so fun and so comfortable. I love the shoulder and I love the polka dots and I love a mini dress. I think it's just so special. This at the races would be, wow, spectacular. Then we have a suit. Oh my goodness, I love this suit. I have not stopped talking about this suit. I posted so many Instagram stories in it. Again, it does have half white, half pink, so you would have to ask the bride. I'm sure it would be absolutely fine because the trousers are pink. It's so cool. You don't have to wear a dress, you know. Why not go for that business chic look and go for the business suit? This is also really soft and really comfy, and the trousers are so comfy, which is so important if you're going to be, like, somewhere abroad. But I just... If you're going to be somewhere abroad or eating a lot, but I just think this is the perfect, like evening dinner outfit, races outfit, christening outfit. I'm honestly a woman obsessed. I've got this one, which is a little bit different, but the reason I showed this is because it's actually beige, and one of my friends was like, I want people to wear beige to my wedding. I don't mind if they wear white. Obviously, I'm not going to wear white, but each bride is different, and this is like a really beautiful milky beige color. I just think halter nets with like this kind of cutout design are so cute. I would personally wear this on holiday versus to a wedding, but for a destination wedding, if the bride does want you to wear neutral colors, it could actually be a great shout. Then some more polka dot numbers. This is a polka dot shirt dress i think this would be amazing for a christening or for like a special dinner or for wimbledon or an event like that i think it's so classy because it's a shirt and it has the belt around it's giving kate middleton i absolutely love it another poker number which you'll see on the screen i think i'm going to wear this all summer long again i think this is going to be great for like work meetings special occasions you could definitely wear this one to like the races and i just love the poker i'm seeing a lot of people wearing pokers as wedding guest dresses and i am here for it <gasps> Then we're on to the green numbers. Oh my gosh, Matt, my boyfriend, actually walked in when I was wearing this and he was like, that's incredible. I think this would be the perfect bridesmaid dress. I am so impressed with the quality. I just wish I sized down. I got a size 8 and these were in a little bit too big for me. But the great thing is you can get these things taken in. This is the halter neck version, which I absolutely love. Like I say, a bit too big for me, but so stunning. Would be amazing bridesmaid, amazing for a special occasion, or amazing for a wedding. My boyfriend was like, you should wear that to a wedding. They actually do this in pink. They do this in nude. They do a cream one. If I was getting married, I would so get the cream one and put my bridesmaids in it. Then they also have this boob tube version again, comes in all the different colors. 
and again it's a little bit too big for me but <laughs> I love it it's so nice comment below I don't know your feelings on shoulders out for a wedding one of my friends is getting married in a church and she was saying that people need to cover their shoulders up in the church so obviously I wouldn't wear this to her wedding but my other friends are like yeah wear anything so this could actually be really nice particularly if it's a very hot wedding I just think the material is so good the quality and the price of this I am so impressed I think that's like my number one place for wedding guest dresses at the moment this one's a little bit different it's a little bit quirkier it's more of like a boho holiday dress but if you're going to a wedding in like Mexico or something this would be so fun it's giving temple vibes or Zimmerman vibes without the price tag and I actually think it's really fun for like Barbados or something like that okay if you are a bride I have to put this on the screen I think this is the most insane dress I've ever seen it comes like a cake like you get the whole dress and then it turns into a mini two-piece if I was getting married I would be keeping this and I would be wearing this on my bachelorette and I would feel like an absolute queen I would wear a crown with it I would be dancing around I think it's the nicest dress I have ever put on in terms of like I felt like a princess it's so fun and the fact that it's a two-in-one dress I think that is so special then I got this little halter neck number I think this again would be really nice for a destination wedding I actually love the color I'm not really into like really bright colors but I love that it's kind of muted and it's ruffled anything chiffony for me is really nice for a special occasion speaking of not being into colors I did get a pink dress that I actually love for a destination wedding it will be absolutely beautiful or maybe on like a bachelorette or something because it's quite fun it's kind of like fishtail and long and again it's a little bit too big for me I definitely need to get it taken in but it's just great for like a fun trip abroad or a special occasion abroad I would say if you're going to more of a black tie event I actually got a really lovely one shoulder black dress you'll have seen it feature on some of my vlogs I cannot wait to wear it it has like a slit on the leg but it's a long maxi and it's one shoulder for some reason I love one shoulder things I just think they look so classy and so gorgeous and I'm definitely into my long dresses but I love it when they have a split in the leg I'm just looking through my phone to see what's in my wardrobe to talk to you about and oh my god how could I forget this one this dress it gives me like kind of temple vibes or Zimmerman vibes it's so gorgeous it's cut out but because it's floral and like puff sleeved I think it's going to be amazing for weddings I cannot wait to wear this for a special occasion like I'm looking at the pictures now and I'm like oh, I am so excited to wear this I feel like I need lots of nice fun occasions now I've got these gorgeous dresses I did also buy myself a dress from Reformation I got it in the cell and it's like completely backless with a tie neck and it's long and I think it's just going to be so beautiful for summer season when we have like garden parties weddings picnics those special occasions I'm just editing this video hello and I realized that there's two videos that I've missed out one on the left hand side which I love it's actually in the sale right now and it's like a pink open dress I think it's going to be so nice it's obviously quite plungy but you can pop a safety pin there I think it's going to be so nice for special occasions this summer I am in love with it my friend was actually like please wear that to my wedding and then I just tried this number on and I think it's so nice I do do this in white obviously you cannot wear that to a wedding but I thought wow this is such a nice affordable wedding guest dress it wasn't that expensive at all like I say I'll link it below I'm also here for pink because this is like a nice kind of pink it's not like I mean it's very pink but it's not like a neon pink I guess it's just a really nice like satiny silky pink it's giving me kind of like Rixo vibes but without the price so thought I would pop in and pop those on screen for you and link them below so I really just wanted to talk you through the kind of dresses that I have in my wardrobe that I'm thinking about for wedding season or event season like I say whether you have a prom a graduation a wedding guest I think ultimately if you're concerned speak to the bride but also one of my friends said to me well if you have to speak to the bride there's definitely a problem with your dress I would say I don't agree with that personally speaking I just think Honestly, like sometimes it is courteous to ask if you are friends with the bride. Like I went to my friend's wedding last year and wore a yellow lace dress and I wanted to run it by her and she was like, love it. And I'll definitely be running my dresses via the brides this year just because I think it's nice to talk about it and get excited. But obviously like don't feel pressure if you want to play it safe. Obviously just go for like a coloured dress. Don't go for something that's like got any white in it. But like I say, a lot of brides really don't care as long as it's patterned and it's not like a wedding dress. And then when it comes to the races and stuff, honestly, anything goes. So many of these dresses will be perfect for the races. I like wearing white, so it's good that actually you can wear those kind of patterned white dresses definitely to things like the races or a christening. I love the idea of the power suit. I think we don't always have to wear dresses. People don't want to wear dresses. So how about a jumpsuit, power suit kind of vibe or a suit? 
I do also have a blog post with so many ideas that I am updating honestly on a weekly basis with new wedding guest dresses, new occasion dresses, anything that you can think of it will be on there. So it's on my blog, mtalks.co.uk. I do also rent out my wardrobe. So if you are wanting something for a special occasion, but you're like, I'm only gonna wear it once. So many of my gorgeous pieces are actually available for rent, which is really exciting. I've already got a few girls renting them for wedding guest season or the races or Wimbledon and things like that, which excites me so much because obviously these pieces are investment pieces, but if you feel like you're only gonna wear them once, you may as well just rent it. So I will link my profile below for that as well. So yes, I really hope you found this useful. I really hope you find the blog post useful and let me know which dresses you like, let me know which dresses you don't like and comment below and let me know what occasions you've got coming up. But I hope you like this chill, chatty video. Sorry it was fast. I get really excited when I'm talking about things. I get really fast when I'm talking about things I'm excited about. But yeah, I just wanted to talk to you about this and I will see you guys next time. Also this one, we got another little cutie. But yeah, I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. All my love. Come say hi on Instagram. Everything I mentioned was linked below. All my love.